Hey everybody, welcome back to Guns and Gadgets, your source for Second Amendment news. Excuse the hand, I'm holding the, the phone, uh, I'm not in the studio. Uh, before I hit the rack for the evening, I thought I'd share this interesting fact from Baltimore, Maryland. Why do regular, normal citizens need their Second Amendment rights? Especially in Maryland, where it's uh, a very anti-gun uh, flavor to the state. There was an activist, well there is an activist... Uh, her name is Erica Bridgeford, and she was pushing for a 72-hour ceasefire this past weekend in Baltimore. And she even called it the Nobody Kill Anybody weekend. Can't make this stuff up. So she wanted all Friday, all Saturday, and all Sunday to be a ceasefire in the city of Baltimore, Maryland. Um, the police and the city government even got behind this and sponsored uh, or got, you know, not sponsored it, but um, endorsed it. You know, it's funny that the city would get behind this type of movement and the police department would get behind this type of movement instead of doing what needs to be done and that's taking control of your city. This is the same mayor that let the rioters take control of the city two years ago and even ordered police to stand down and let looters burn the city down. That's the type of problem you have in Baltimore. It's your leadership. It absolutely sucks. And she even got some gang leaders in Maryland that called her and agreed to honor this ceasefire. Well, why would they be doing this anyway? Well, Baltimore has less than one-tenth the population of New York City, yet to date has uh, 48 more homicides than New York City does. So they pushed this Nobody Kill Anybody weekend. And it lasted all day Friday, and then there were two <laughs> fatal shootings on Saturday. So it didn't last long. Now, Baltimore's murder rate this point this year is 20% higher than it was last year. Nothing is going to get this done other than the city, the state, and the police enforcing laws on the books, taking criminals off the street. That's it. Good guys carrying guns stop bad guys carrying guns. Case in point. Quick little update from Baltimore, Maryland, from the Nobody Kill Anybody weekend. Can't make this up. Hope you all have a good one until we see each other again. Be safe, stay vigilant, carry a weapon. Take care, everybody.